This video is brought to you by Facebook Gaming. We're building the world's gaming community. Join us and help shape a creator-first gaming platform where you can build your own community around the games you love to stream. In a time of great uncertainty and chaos, one man will rise to rescue humanity from the brink once again by doing what he does best. Shoving his boot all the way up hell's ass. And this time, you better bring your Dramamine. Oh man, I'm gonna hurl. Doom Eternal. Chainsaw your way into another rocket-propelled gore orgy. A gorgy, if you will. In the sequel to the actually good Doom reboot that everyone thought was impossible to pull off. And watch as its software slathers a whole new layer of intensity and mechanics on top of the old ones that will force you to engage with the new systems or get turned into paste in a matter of seconds. As every engagement devolves into a desperate struggle for health, armor, and ammo that you'll have to saw, punch, or flamethrower out of enemies and flitter around the map like a fairy made of hate in search of the next demon's candy-colored guts. In a gameplay experience that's less about the fantasy of being an unstoppable killing machine and more about doing emergency self-care with a shotgun that somehow also became one of the weirdest hybrid memes just because it came out at the same time as Animal Crossing. I guess even Doom Guy needs to unwind after the mass demon extinction. Completely relatable. Discover the bizarre choices it made with Doom Eternal's storyline that leaves behind the understated hints at a larger universe that powered its predecessor for a full-on Doom cinematic universe that rivals the other DCU in Edgelord Darkness. Why did you say that, Dad? With a new cast of antagonists, several fictional races with funny names to learn. If I become Maker, way of Kodak's progress. You can use the Maker's origin factory in the Hell City of Necrovol to pass through the void. Insane fantasy cities to visit, your dope-ass floating paladin castle ship, and an elaborate backstory for the Doom Guy that it seems to be taking seriously, while at the same time showing his epic guitar collection and letting you dress him up in meme costumes. All playing out across so many cutscenes, even the protagonist seems pretty bored with it all. If Sentinel Holy Blood is spilled on these grounds, you will. Look, 95% of the fan base couldn't give a single shit about this. Just let me know why Doom Guy is still mad and make with the shooty. Explore the intricate twists and turns of Eternal's map design as the new game replaces the original's darker future facility aesthetic with a more colorful and arcadey romp through a variety of ludicrous set pieces filled with glowing intractable spots that you'll swing around like an Olympic gymnast as you parallel bar your way through the level as you combine it with a dash to smash yourself into the next uncharted wall to climb. Just to miss it by a tiny hair and plummet to your, well, doom. In greatly expanded first-person platforming that caused them to design half the combat arenas like elaborate jungle gyms. Or backing yourself into a corner and losing like four lives as demons do the night at the Roxbury thing to you. <laughs> Conquer the greatest challenges Eternal has to offer as you face off against brutal bosses that take an immense amount of punishment, then show up in regular encounters later because f you, like the Doom Hunter who's basically just a demon tank, the Archvile who lives up to his Doom 2 heritage by just being a real dick, and the demon that launched a thousand think pieces, the Marauder, a shielded asshole that forces you to drop everything you're doing and duel with him like he slapped you with a white glove and will casually destroy you if you don't fight him in a specific way after you shoot his stupid demon dog a million times. In a controversial shift in the mow everything down with the chainsaw gameplay that probably wasn't made any more popular by that challenge where they give you like 30 seconds to kill one. Oh, you wanted your ammo back after failing? You are adorable like little baby. So cock that super shotgun and get ready to get gamer mad as Doom Eternal rips and tears you a brand new asshole with a confused mishmash of new ideas that hit and miss in equal measure, but with plenty of that 2016 Doom under the hood to keep it from straying too far from the light. 
I mean, you feed this guy his own heart again. That's basically a doomed tradition. Starring The Walking Dead, Call of Kablooey, Barbecue Imp, Gorgoyles, Deep Throat, Prang! Put a shirt on for God's sake. Moves. Demon Belmont, up in that ass. Slippery Boys, one in the stink. The Rockettes, Spawn Camping, Citizen Kane. This guy comes up and slap your girlfriend's ass. What do you do? Donate tokens for more time. Some characters from the story you didn't pay attention to. And Electric Devastation Carnival. Okay, Doomer. Oh, yeah, there's also a multiplayer mode. It's better than the last time, I guess. Maybe the third game people will actually care. This video is brought to you by Facebook Gaming. Go live and start streaming the games you love. Gun skills are effective against those that are weak to guns. Steel is my body and fire is my blood. We all make mistakes in the heat of passion, Jimbo.